Alright, so today we're taking a look at a dictionary application known as Arthur. Now Arthur is a offline dictionary, so you don't have to be connected to the web for it to work, and by default it will sit up in your system tray here. Uh, as you can see, I am running the, uh, the GNOME 2 notification area extension here on GNOME Shell, and basically it will give you the definitions of synonyms, antonyms, derivatives relating to, and attributes. So it's really quite a powerful tool, and, I've, and I'm surprised that I only just found it recently, because uh, it's actually been a tool I've been looking for for quite some time. Now it uses WordNet 2.0 as its back end, so you do have a vast database of words there available. So you can see here, as soon as you put it in entry, we have a uh, we have a definition. We've got similar and domain uh, as far as whether the word is trademarked or not. Now you also have a very nice indication here as to how often it's used in everyday language. You can see here, Linux, very rare. Uh, an open source version of the Unix operating system. Now what's nice about this program is just that it's got such a widespread backend and it gives some very simple down-to-earth definitions that are easy to understand and then it gives you some synonyms and antonyms as well. So as you can see here with the word require, it is a verb, it says uncommon, gives you the definitions and then you've got some synonyms here such as necessitate, ask, postulate, da 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 da. You've also got derivatives, similar words and kinds. Now this application is not that much to download and it is available in the default Ubuntu repos. Now, of course, you can get it from their website, which is a SourceForge page, so you can download the source code in whatever latest version you would like. Now, one of my commenters on Google Plus said that Arthur is equivalent to the word meaning in Sanskrit, which is obviously pretty nice for a dictionary to be named that. So yes, of course, if you're not following me on Google Plus, I am now on Google Plus, and I shall post whatever random things I come across there. So definitely check out Arthur, it is a very nice dictionary tool to have around, and it sits up in your system tray unless you tell it to quit, so it's quite nice, very minimalist, gets the job done, and you can see all of the main features and development necessities here on their wiki page. You can also set up hotkeys, so that you can automatically search a highlighted word with a particular uh, keyboard combination, and you can see all of the different types of output it can give you per whatever word you enter into the search bar. I shall put some links in the description below. Thank you once again everybody for your support and I shall see you next week with another distro review.